Hey, cute people. You saw the title, right? And it is true. This is another haul. I mentioned to you in the last video that I had more stuff that I had purchased. And like I said, I put it down or it gets delivered and I just leave it there until I decide, hey, I need to start putting this stuff away for the next things I'm going to buy or order. But um, yeah, I'm going to get right into the video. But I do want to mention... You guys see, I finally washed my hair, so I don't have a scarf or a, a, a head wrap or anything on my hair. And right now, I have to say, I don't like my hair at all. It's grown an awful lot. It's grown an awful lot, and it has no shape to it, really. I had to pat it like this, and then I don't like it because it looks like I patted it like this. But I was thinking about doing another big chop, and it was either going to be December 31st or January 1st, but I'm not really sure yet. Um, I'll decide because I want to do something different with my hair I'll talk about that later on and another thing I do want to mention is this is the old year going out and a new year is coming in so if you're here watching the video why don't you just go ahead and subscribe it costs you nothing you know that and if you do subscribe of course you'll see more of me which is a good thing I think and it won't always be hauls because I mentioned I am going to be on a no low buy in 2020 I think I mentioned in the last video, there's three things that I want to get. And if they do go on sale, 2020, I'm getting them. But other than that, that's pretty much going to be about it. There's a lot of other things that I want, but I don't wear makeup as much. So I got to, you know, slow down a little bit. But here's some things that I picked up from Target. And one thing I noticed about Target here in North Carolina, you can go to a Target in Fayville, one in Greenville, Jacksonville, New Bern, um, Raleigh, Charlotte, and everybody have something different. This I had not known about, but, well, some of them. And I'm glad that I found them. But one thing that I picked up, and I have this in black, and I believe it's supposed to come in, um, it just says assorted prints, this one here. And this is the Evolve Wrap Scarf. And I'm so glad I got it. And you know this is right up my alley. Tie up my hair and keep it moving. This is the print that I have here. And on the back it shows you different ways in which you can wear it. As a head wrap. A chignon. Wait. A sh Here's the word. Yeah. A turban. And as a bandeau. Bandeau. Which is to me is just like a, I don't know, a wrap on your head. I don't know. But anyway, so I got this. I cannot remember how much it was. It wasn't an awful lot of money. I have never seen the this particular print in Walmart. I have a black one, like I mentioned, and I like it. It's pretty long, so I figured, hey, I'll go ahead and get this one. I should have had it open, but at first I wasn't going to open it because I just wanted to move along this video rather quickly. And here's the print. Now, if I could find more prints and colors, because I have a black one, like I said, I would get more, but isn't that, isn't that nice? Yeah. So, this here I got from Target. I don't know if they have them in Walmart, but um, I'm looking for some other prints, so I hope I come across those soon. And, like I said, now this here, these surprised me. These are products by Cantu. I got this one because as you can see, I have a lot of hair and even at my age, my hair is thinning, but it's still thick. So you can imagine what I used to deal with a couple of years ago, which was okay. But this one here is a thick hair clip. I don't know if um, they had other, it says extra hole. I don't know if you can see that there. I don't know if they had other sizes. I can't remember. But here, if you go to the website, it just tells you where you can purchase the items from I don't think it said like well I don't think you could order from the site but check to make sure I think it's because they have the site listed here yeah and what it is it's made for thicker hair to clip into a pony or poof with ease okay used with Cantu's curl activator cream and edge gel that's what it says on the back that's a suggestion and then I got these here too because I had some of these by Diane and they all broke now these here are thicker than the ones I wish I had the ones from Diane here so I could show you but these are thicker and what I like about them is that let me see if I can I should have been ready with a lot of the stuff right but I wasn't, oh goodness, it's going to take forever to get it out. But it has a little hooks on the end. So it's just a hook that goes around your head. So you 
put your hair in a ponytail, you wrap this around, and the two hooks, you, the two hooks, you clamp them together. Yeah, that's how it is. And I like these better than the um, ponytail holders because they don't break as fast. Now, they can come out of the um, holder because the holder is like steel or some type of metal. But if you open it up, you can just put it right back in. So I like those. And I like them because they're thicker than the ones that I had gotten from Diane. And then another time I was in, I think maybe even that same Target, I had seen what I'm going to show you in this bag. But I wasn't wanting to spend that kind of money because I thought these were overpriced but I said if I see them in another Target or if I come back to this one and they're still available I'll go ahead and get them and that is these two easy wraps they're slide on fashion bands so I got these and they were $11.99 each I think they were that was yeah that's too much I think these things should be like six $5.99 if you ask me, but it was so pretty and they stayed on my mind. So I went on and got them Like I said, I really didn't want to spend that much money for them. It says new I don't know if you can see that now how new it is that I don't know But this is what they look Like you just wrap it on your head and I got the two patterns So I'm really not gonna be doing my hair now and then here you have like the little thing in the front I know it doesn't have a name but yeah so I'm glad I got those those will come in handy for the summer because you can see all three of those scars that I showed you are vibrant colors and then I went to Walmart yeah I sure did and I picked up some stuff one thing I want to show you guys is this here this is a um it's by Ziploc zip lock and it was in the beauty section I believe where they have the um travel bags and such contain the clutter it has five of these bags here and what i like about them the bags have different styles i didn't open it but i'll show you they're plastic and they're ziploc so if you're traveling somewhere or you want to put one in your purse things that could spill and leak you can definitely put your makeup in it and put it in your bag or things that leak you can do um electronics if you want but this was like 4.99 4.98 really and it wasn't expensive so i said i have to get in like i mentioned it's five bags and you can see how big they are and here's what designs are in the collection i believe all of them have the same design but on the front there was a different bag but they all had the same five bags and as you can see here it is and it opens up where it can stand i don't know if you can see it here so you can just put stuff in it and if you are traveling you can put it on the um towel that goes on the counter so that you won't be getting a whole bunch of nasty germs so i picked that up and i think they call it a reusable accessory bag and i thought these were fabulous i don't do an awful lot of traveling but i do some traveling and then they had these bandanas they had these in a lot of pretty styles y'all but i only got three i wanted to get more but i only got three and i believe they were only a dollar so here's one and this is what it would look like and these are bandanas and i got this pretty pink one um, and then this one here, I got this one, which is just some lines. Did I show these to y'all good enough so y'all can see? Let's see how big they are. Okay, let's see. I don't know if they still have them or not. Um, but you know, um, at the age now, I'm going to cover my hair because I don't feel like doing it. See, this is how long it is. Well, this is how long it is. So it's pretty long. Okay. So pretty be pretty um as well. They had a lot of different um patterns, but these are the patterns that I got. And as you can see they're pretty long and they're really pretty colors. All the other colors were pretty too. But like I said, I just picked these three. I would have gotten them all. As a matter of fact, the next time I go to Walmart, I'm gonna look to see if they have any more. Now this is something that I picked up. I believe I think I'm going to like this, but I'm not really sure. It's the Equate Beauty Automatic Makeup Brush Cleaner. You can clean and dry your makeup brush in seconds. It's adjustable to fit most brush sizes. And this is what it looks like. 
Now, when I went to Walmart and picked this up that time, there were like hmm, three or four. I went back and they were all gone. So I hope that, um, let's see here. I'm going to show you how this work is, works as a matter of fact. Yeah, so what you do is you insert your makeup brush handle into the device clamp until it's secure. You prepare a bowl or cup of soapy water, which is not included. Ha ha ha. You dip the bristles into the water and you press the button to spin it and clean it. Then you lift the brushes out of the water to spin dry. And I do have to get some AAA batteries, which I don't have. So I'm going to get some. And as you know, Equate is Walmart's brand. So I am looking forward to using this. The only thing about it is that you can only wash one brush at a time, I guess. Yeah. So get back to me with this because in the next couple of days, I'm going to try this out with some brushes because I've been buying brushes like... I don't have any sense like what I'm going to show you right now and you'll see exactly what I mean because I have been buying brushes like crazy. But I am really, really excited about that. So hopefully you'll check me on that. Now, Target had some sales going on a good while ago. When did I purchase these? Let me see. I purchased this back in October, the early part of October. So I went on and I purchased, because I always, when I first started watching YouTube videos, everyone used to always talk about Sonya Kashuk brushes. And I always said I wanted to get some. But when I look at the price sometimes, like I told you, I do haul a lot, but I get most things on sale. Trust me when I tell you. If it's on sale, it's up my alley. So they had a sale and the brushes were 20% off, but I missed the sale for whatever reason. I missed the sale. I didn't get them. And then I waited a little while longer. And what happened? They went on sale again for 30% off. I said, I'm not missing it. Not at all. Like if you get, they don't have any of the prices here, do they? Nope. 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 I don't remember what the full price, but these are the brushes that I got. Yeah. I got five. I got six brushes. And I like how they come with these little protectors on. I mean, I'm going to take them off, of course, but I'm going to keep the, um... Okay, so this brush I got, let me go through it real quick. I'm going to tell you what she tells me this is. This is a powder brush. And I cannot wait to use it. It's so soft. I mean, this brush is so soft. Again, this is the powder brush. And this is from the, um, Essential Collection. And there's a lot of different styles or collections that she has. But I like this one because it's gold and it's pretty. I think it's plastic. And this one here is the flat top foundation brush, which I cannot wait to use. I'm getting excited about makeup again, y'all. Here's the brush. Again, real dense, real dense and very soft. And I cannot wait to use it. And it has the Sonia Kashuk emblem there, her brand. And really, really nice. And like I mentioned, I'm going to keep those plastic things so when I travel, I can put the brush in. Because this is definitely the brush set I'm going to take when I travel. And I like this little cute flat top concealer brush. I was like, I think this is what got me started. Because I was in the store looking at the brushes and I said, ooh, I like this. Look at this little cute flat top concealer brush. Real, again, soft, very dense, really, really nice. I cannot wait to use it. Um, I didn't get any eyeshadow brushes. I got face brushes. And this one here is the highlighter and fan brush, which it is a little thicker than any fan brush that I already have especially as a matter of fact I think I only have one fan brush and that's elf and this is definitely thicker than that and look at the little plastic case that comes in this one doesn't stay shut I don't know why but yeah and then I got two more brushes and the last one here this is a blush brush now, the blush brush that I usually use is the one from Real Technique Techniques, and that's a big old thick brush. Let me see if I can find it around these here parts. Bo, 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 bo. Where is it? Where is it? Here it is. This is the blush brush from Real Techniques. Can you see the difference? Let me see. Yeah, can you see the difference? Yeah. But this one I really do like, but this one I think I'm going to love. And again, really, really soft. And here it comes in the little 
protective case. And yes, yes, I may even keep the um <laughs> the label on it. You know, I keep stuff. And this one here is um, a contour brush, which is another brush that I cannot wait to use. Let's see, contour. Again, another soft brush. Really, really dense. It feels really, really good. So I can't wait to use this. As a matter of fact, if I get a chance, maybe I'll take these brushes and wash them with my new brush cleaner from Walmart. Hey, how about that? So those are the six brushes that I picked up from Target. The um, Sonia Kushik collection. And she has a lot of nice brushes. Like I said... I wanted to get some of her eyeshadow brushes, but I decided against it. And why did I do that? Because not long after that, I was sent um, mm, and a coupon, a coupon from Ulta. But one thing about this bag here, even though you, you can tell it was definitely for the month of October, I believe I did purchase this in early. November so that was really my last purchase but they still had these pretty bags which I'm glad I got one because it is really pretty and I just picked up three things and that was three brushes that I felt I really needed some more of um this they're Morphe Morphe brushes and the three that I picked up the first one is a smudger brush I have a little smudger brush that I use from elf but i thought this would be a little bit better i'm not going to open it up because i don't want this video to go too much past 20 minutes and it already is so this is the little smudger brush and i like it because it's small and petite and then i got this one here which is the 217 it's a bent liner brush which is what i need because i told you guys i have a problem and i think it's because i'm getting older i have a problem putting eyeliner on um so I got this. Let me just show you this. It's, this video is going to be longer than I wanted it to be. But I did show you guys a lot of stuff, right? So I got this one only because, like I mentioned, I need it. And I hope that it helps me, but it's really, really fine. Okay. Oh, this is pretty good. It's not a brush, really. It's more like um, maybe a piece of plastic, so it's good. I don't know. Um, to use with um, the eyeliner gel and just place it. So I'll, I'll see how this works. Because it's not really a brush with bristles. It's more like, like I mentioned, um, some type of plastic. But I'm going to see how I like it. And then the last brush that I picked up um, was the 321 Bullet Crease Brush. And this is the Bullet Crease Brush. And only reason why is because um, I want to get more into color with eyeshadow and I realized that you have to take your time with placement getting things right and believe me when I tell you and I really do mean this it is so hard for me to see um, certain things that I'm trying to do so I figured maybe a brush would be a little bit helpful to me so I got this one here and the Morphe brushes I love how they feel they feel so nice in your hand so those are the three brushes that I got from Morphe so that is my haul as you can see there wasn't much beauty items just a whole bunch of stuff mm -hmm. to find places to put things like usual you buy stuff and you gotta figure out where am i gonna put all this stuff but yeah that's what i got in a nutshell and um yeah i'm still waiting for two packages to come things that i ordered one for the Black Friday from Juvia's Place. And I did order some stuff for Miss A. And pretty much, like I said, that's going to be it. Believe me when I tell you, I told you in the last video, the three things that I'm looking for. If they go on sale in 2020, I'm getting them. But listen, people, I'm about to close this video because I got to go. I got to get out of here. I have to go pick up some food. I really don't want to. But, um... My family, we have to eat, right? So, I am going to say goodbye. And um, thanks again for stopping by and watching this video. Hopefully, I'll see you in the next. And, um, yeah, subscribe for more me. Especially because you want to see how that brush cleaner works. You definitely should subscribe. So, like I said, I'm going to close this video because my nose is starting to run. I tell you, whenever I put on makeup, what's, what's up with that? Yeah. 
But listen, guys, I want you to do nothing but share and spread love.